Hello everyone, my name is Apo, welcome back to School of Dragons. So today we will continue Call of the Death Song expansion pack. And here I came to work with my second newest dragon, my Razor Rip Lady. And I named her Lady after also one of the six werewolf pups from the series Game of Thrones. So some of you remember Shaggy Dog, my night terror, he was the first. And here is Lady, she is the second. And I also bought the full set of a Death Song Black Armor. I also have the faceplate, but I didn't put it on because I really don't like it. But I have everything else on me and it looks really cool. And also, something else, I said second newest. There is a reason for that. And I will tell you why right now. So, Lady has a sister. And if you remember in the ship graveyard, when I helped out that rogue dragon rider, uh, she did not give me one razor rib egg, but two. And since the both eggs came from the same razor rib, Winchia, she is the mother of the both eggs, so they are sisters. And here, this is Lady, so after the dark pop lady from the throne, and her sister is named Cersei or also named after one of the characters from the Game of Thrones. For those who don't know, Cersei is the queen of the Seven Kingdoms in that series. And here, this is her, this is Cersei, and, but even though their sisters are very different, so she doesn't like humans, I'm not sure, even sure that she likes me, I'm not so scared of her, and she doesn't really like me out with anyone. And at first her name was supposed to be Nymeria, because in the series, Lady's sister is named Nymeria, and but I decided to mix things up a little, so I named her Cersei, and I will name Nymeria one other dragon that I will yet decide. I have some ideas, but I don't really yet know yet. So, and while well, Cersei is very distant, she's full of anger, she's full of hate, probably because she never met her mother. Uh, she never met Finchir, so she doesn't know who her mother is, and she is full of anger to those humans, she doesn't like people, she doesn't even like Vikings a lot. Lady is very gentle, she's very gentle, she likes me, she is loyal to me, and she will join me today. So let me just simply make her happy a little. So here you heard the story, and I will repeat, as I said many times before, for many different things, I did not hack the game. So it is probably a glitch and I got lucky that I have it. So I got two free dragons instead of one and it's a glitch, it's not a hack, I did not hack the game, hacking is bad and I will never do that. Okay, and now after I explained everything about the lady, the gentle one and Cersei, the angry one, she's full of anger and everything, we have a new quest from Astrid and we will do it right away. So, hi Astrid! I'm counting on you. Journey to Death Song Island. Well, we fi I finally get to see Melody Island. If the Dragon Islands isn't in the ship graveyard, we need to figure out where else it could be. Now, what I'm about to ask of you is very dangerous, but it's our best option. Snapple scouted Death Song Island and he says that the dangerous dragon isn't there. Now, now is our best chance to look for the Dragon Islands. The archaeologist has been wrecking his memories and he thinks he saw an artifact like it at the island. You talk to him. Okay. I don't know if he is on this song island or... No, he is a perk. But where? Oh, he is... He is... Oh, here we are. Here we are. So do I talk to him? It's been years since I was there, but there was a remnant of an ancient civilization there. I collected many relics and artifacts, but I wasn't able to take them all off the island when I was chased off by some ten threatening dragons. I know it will be dangerous, but I know you will do your best to protect me. Into the great beyond! Let's go to the dangerous island that the death song calls home, Melody Island. Wow, I finally get to see this. Flying. And here, so Lady, she is very adventurous. She likes she likes exploring, and she loves to find other lands, other dragons to play with. She's very playful, and she loves going into the unknown. 
but seriously, she is so full of anger. I don't understand why. I mean, maybe because she never met her mother, but I know she doesn't like Vikings, she doesn't like dragons, and I will agree with me. But to the Melody Island! Melody Island is a sweet name for a very dangerous place. I have to explore this place. And the music it's it's beautiful. Check this whoa whoa, sorry, sorry. This well this is fun no. This style is very interesting. Let's see. So we have this exit. And you can fish here. It's cool. So there is one exit there and one here. This leads to the sea. This is majestic. It's very small to the one that uh, that's so made on in the Swiss farm in Burke. But it looks so much bigger and all this amber and ground. Look, dragon rooms. I don't I never I never really noticed that when I was here this time. Look at this. They're very detailed I have to say. So I want to see it from above. I want to see every possible place or area or tunnel or something. And it looks like that song isn't here, which is going to us. Okay, I will go to this is the highest peak and I will take a very good look at it. A look at this beautiful and very musical island. I really love the music. Okay, so we start up there, and there is this path to the nest, and there is a secret cave. We have this little beach. I see something down here, it's probably the old camp. There is something like you know, a cove, but we have water and very good foods. We have these narrow passages. I love climbing here. I love them when, uh, I'm, for example, when I was finished with Isom Island, I would fly over there. I really love exploring. And it looks like all these narrow little passages, let's, let's call them, and all these narrow areas will be perfect for training the fleet and flying. I mean, it's really cool. But now let's meet the archaeologist. But the island is really detailed, I really like it. Oh, rock, did that see anything? Okay, here is the arc. So slow moving. But still, I like that I have this armor, it makes me look at that song. Really good. Ah, 
can ever use my gun brush, it will be impossible to carefully move this soil away from the new bird this year. And a big axe. So where is that? One handbrush, one trowel, and one pickaxe. Thank you, Mokomi. We need to find the Grand Islands before the dragon gets back. We will cover more ground in this pit up. Why don't we try heading down toward the trees? This path must be a bit familiar to me. Maybe you will draw a few memories. Okay, yes. So I don't know which path it means because there are all the paths. So I'll just follow this arrow. That sound was that the song the archaeologist might be in trouble. What sound? I don't hear anything. teleporter just automatically brings you. Very good, very good. That's quite enough adventure for now. I hope this land holds safe to the feet in the deck of Singapore. I'm sure you'll be able to get the safer red red cup soon. And we get one dragon island. And we can go to quest. And my game is level up. So now let's see what else. So now I'm crossing Astrid. Okay, well, let's check out the characters. So nothing from Astrid, nothing, nothing from the Schlangs, nothing from the Twins. We have a hiccup quest. Okay, let's do that recap quest and let's check everyone else. So nothing from Bucket. A Snowplot has a quest for us. Okay. And let's check Mouch. Mouch. I don't think that he has, but anyway. No, he hasn't. Okay, well we have a hiccup quest and a snapple quest. Okay, I will do hiccup quest first. Let's see, hiccup, hiccup. And nothing from Gobber. And nothing from from Volca. Oh, two quests for Rika. Okay. One, this one, this one, this one. I don't know, this one. Let's see this one. My friends and I could use your help with this. I've been thinking about maybe we're looking at this the wrong way. I think we can find a way to coexist peacefully with this song. After all, it created a giant nest and birth naturally. Can we figure out a way to convince the dragon to save him without eating all our dragons? 
Can you talk to bot to the botanist? She might have some good ideas. Okay, talk to the botanist. She's all the way at the lookout. Okay, so I finally at the lookout. Let's see what botanist has to see. The day is not playing with the bug. That could be very bad for the bird the ecosystem. You see, there are invasive species in the plant and animal world. An invasive species in an organism that is not native to the ecosystem because it was not originally in the ecosystem, it causes damage to the environment, economy, or health of the native species. <coughs> I'll show you what I mean. Have you ever on a combat on an invasive species in the wilderness? Go to the wilderness for... Now to the wilderness. Really? Okay, let's see <coughs> what we have to do. The meadow. We have some targets. Can I shoot them? I've got a lot of fire of the laser, which is so cool. These trees pose a serious problem to this meadow. If the weeds are allowed to grow, they will soon begin to spread out across the entire meadow. It will take all the resources when the plants are belong to on those original plants will all die. Any animals that rely on the, re on the original plants to live will also die. This one tiny leaf will eventually break the ecosystem of the wilderness. Can you tell Lady to burn the seed? Very careful not to burn the field. Okay, Lady, you can start. Okay, because it will help the wind yet to take over the ecosystem of the wilderness. So you see, Bert is a name I like. It, Bert is like a meadow. The death song is like the wind. We already know that the death song is a very dangerous dragon, but its presence as bar could Im imbalance the ecosystem. It could take over and destroy our environment, our dragons, and our way of life. I'm sorry for the bad news, but please tell me that there is little hope of the dragon ever peacefully in so close with me as in Bert. Okay, can I show you? Are you? No, nothing happens. Okay, let's stop the pick up. I'll go to Burke right away so that the quest completes after we talk to the so I can go uh, straight to doing another quest without any delay. Talks to who I will don't. Different worlds. Great. Okay, so the server call timed out, and that is why I didn't see the dialogue. So I had to re-enter the game. And when I entered, uh, the game thought that I already had the dialogue with Hiccup, uh, and then it thought that the quest was complete. So I checked my journal. It's not the one moment. Okay, I'm back, so um, it's raining here, so that's why I had to stop for a moment to close the window. And as I said, so it threw me out of the game, and when I came back, it thought that I already had the dialogue with Hiccup. And I checked earlier, it's not there, and unfortunately, I don't know what he said. I really don't, and I'm really sorry that you missed it. But we still have one quest from Hiccup. He is there, and we have a quest from Snapout. So, because Hiccup's quest often glitch, I'll do Snapple quest, and after that I'm afraid I have to end the video. But okay, we can do the Snapple quest. Let's see? It'd be cool if you could handle it for me. You know what, the part? Where's where some Viking see dangerous dragon I hit to run away from? Snapple's is the opportunity! These golden death song and little chunks are perfect materials for everyday good. I mean, we use resources spawned from the earth and animals in our everyday lives. We can turn natural resources into useful resources. There is so much more, more potential around us. If you help me out, I'll make sure you get the cut of the profits. We need the quality resources from the best song island itself. I'll keep an eye out for the dragon and give you warning if he's headed back to his home. Could go to the island and bring, me some, bring back some amber. Okay, so I have to bring... Amber to snap out. Let's go to the song I want. Here. That song Amber is scattered all around the island. You should look for a place with a water pipe called that song Amber. Okay. Let's go 
Probably by the mess. Maybe it's not the tunnel. Because there does not mention the tunnel. So it's probably at his nest. But here, yes. Right. That looks smooth with this song nicely at, at Sven's farm. You must be careful. Take all of chunks of this song and work across the island. Use your axe to chop it into pieces and gather them for stuff. Out. You would be happy with six pieces of this song. I think if I need to talk to everyone else, everyone is there at work, so it will be much quicker. But now it didn't stuck, no it didn't. Actor. See, I learned. It's not, no? I think that he's playing something weird with this, but okay. Here. Thanks. Pretty great! This is it! Oh, these pieces are worth their weight in gold. I can turn this into something very useful for us all. 200 coins! Wow! Good work! The possibilities are endless! I'm going to work with these ember inventions right away. I need to talk to everyone so that they can get the first dibs on the goods. Can you make sure to get the word out so that people know that my special new items are in stock? Thanks, business partner. Did I get to Yes, I got my... 200 coins. Oh, this is actually cool. And I'll probably get some more, but I complete the quest, so very easy way to get rich. So first we have to talk to Gobble. Ah, we'll see about that. Nabla thinks he can make something useful for the test song Ember. It'll be over the laugh at least. I'm in. Okay, hit cup. Yeah, I don't know if I want that, but... Oh, not again. Snuggle is up to no good. Again? How did Snuggle rope you into one of his crazy schemes, Apo? Well, I'll be there. I need to make sure whatever he's, whatever he's doing is harmless to burn. Come on, Tufus. Oh. I'm sorry. Dr. Astrid, where is Lady? Lady, come on. Come here, girl. Astrid, hi. Knock it off, snot loud. That mutton head, this is a serious situa situation. He's just making it worth his dumb money making plans. Oh, he just likes snot to only think about himself. Okay, let's talk to fish legs. Smart Vikings are the best. How interesting. Did snot say what he was making with the death song ember? I'm curious to find out. There might be some really interesting science behind his inventions. Okay, I'll shut for rough net. Oh, I love those skills. What will she say now? Tough Knot has never used that noggin of his. Did he make anything that can use to hit my brother in his head? Oh, that has done nothing wrong. I just like hitting him in the head. Oh my god, rough. Well, how goes it? Oh, this better be a hetero event. If I'm going to be sold something, I expect to be woo wow. Snuggle needs to make me feel appreciated. If he wants to, if he wants me to spend my precious money. Hello. Oh. Got this. Good, you've gathered some exclusive clientele. I'm ready for you all now in the great hall. I got something. What is that? Let's see. 
is this is a dragon heart from the previous quest, so it's worth it is probably worth some nothing important. But let's meet Snowfloat at the Great Hall. Hello? Why can't I enter? I didn't have to not try the dragon. Sorry girl. Girl. Good! Ta-da! Good Vikings of Berk! I have gathered here the greatest in that song Ember technology. Uh, where you're going to be shocked. You're going to be amazed. You're going to want to purchase two of everything. It's just ten coins per mention. What a deal! Yo! Yo! Step right up, little boss, and to take a closer look. I have everything that you might possibly need. One moment. Listening the sound of the golden hue of the best song. So what has he done now? So this is Hiccup and Most his quest. Most impressive. We'll do that another time. Two plus fish legs. Yeah. Can get a good night's sleep because your dragon likes to snore. I'm looking at you here, fish legs. Use these death song ember earplugs to shut up your, the world. You won't be hearing anything while the ember is covering your ears. Oh, it's here on the table. I didn't even notice it. So what is Hiccup looking at? Or Astrid here? All right. These mouths have great grip and perfect storage capacity. The cup is trans translucent, so you can see your liquid while you enjoy. The ember gets sticky with hot drinks. It would stick to cold to cold braves with this cup. Look at the back scratcher. What the what? Oh. Oh my God. Great. This back scratcher is for that one spot on your back that you can never quite reach. If you get an itch there, it can be a terrible night. Use the Death Song Amber back scratcher to satisfy that itching style. Don't put too much pressure on it though. If you aren't careful, you can tear right through your skin. Talk to me a second. Oh, I saved the best for last. Come upstairs to meet me and, uh, and you'll find the prize for helping me out. Oh, Thor, what is he? Ooh. Okay, this line is not appropriate for children. What? What the, the name of Thor is this? I have nightmares! Ugh. Nice! I've made a little statue that you can put in your fire made out of the highest grade ember. I call it Snap Out in Repose. You can have one for free since you helped me out so much during this business venture. Don't ever say I never did you a favor. Dear Thor, please kill me if I am in this hell. Sorry. Well, thank you so much for watching this video. It's been really funny, especially the end with Snazlalut's gift. Well, well, it's really getting funny and interesting and we saw that quest we have a quest from Hiccup, and I think only from Hiccup, but we will do that one in the next video. And I really, really appreciate you're still here with me, it means a to me that you're still here. As I said before, thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you in the next one. So long, Dragon Riders!